All right, guys, so this is the official uh, house tour, this uh, trailer for sale, <laughs> right? Looks so good over there. So he's gonna sh tell us a little bit about the outside and then I'll take over the inside. Um, this is a 2018 Heartland Mallard M302 and it has been completely gutted and renovated. It's M302. I know, but when you look it up, it's M302. Okay, so Brent, explain some things on the outside here. So you have your outside storage, your pass-through storage. Oh, it's a it's, mess right now. It's, it's a hot it's, mess right now. It's a pass-through we'll storage. You guys how big it is. And then you have your controls for your power jacks right here. So this is your front power jacks. This is your rear power jacks. And that helps stabilize. So those are these down here. Helps stabilize the uh, trailer. Yep. And then go front. Then we have the uh, power jack. So you don't have to crank it to get it off the... Uh, your truck or your vehicle, your tow vehicle. Then it comes with two five gallon uh, propane tanks, which connect here. Has two brand new batteries that we just bought a month and a half ago. <coughs> right there. Um, 12 foot awning. We have a 12 foot power awning with LED strip. So that's nice at night. Then we have um, an outdoor, two outdoor speakers. So if you want to listen to music outside, you don't have to have a Bluetooth speaker out here. And that's all controlled inside the, uh, the uh, trailer. You have um, an outside plug. This is where you, you can uh, load your freshwater tank. So if you're doing any boondocking or you're not full hookups with water, that's where you fill your tank up. Furnace, water heater, third tire, outside shower so when you have kids spray them off clean them up outside that's where you hook up your city water right here um, your power your power um, if you want to do satellite this is where you would hook up your satellite or if it, a lot of campgrounds will have uh, cable TV just plug it in right here um, we have, this trailer has two gray tanks so one for the um, kitchen and that's your gray tank right there it has two AC units. Two AC units, 50 amp. Um, and then we have another gray and black tank right here, which is for your uh, toilet and your shower and bathroom. And then um, two that, slides. Two slides. This is going to be your closet. You have a closet. Britt will show you later. There's a closet in the bedroom and then a closet in the uh, bathroom. And that's right here on this slide. And then this is your main living room slide, which then has the couch and table in it thank you all right so i'm going to take you inside and show you what we've done inside um most of the stuff we open the door for you most of the decorations and stuff are staying um all this we're not taking any of the it with everything us everything is power so you don't have so to. this is the entrance i'll show you guys really quick this is the entrance and you walk into the hallway and um, living room um, this is the um, room here sorry I wish I could make it go out wider but I can't so this is the living room area that we have here and this is the kitchen over here which I'll show you more we have two couches that um, came with it or that we put in they're from home reserve so you have a nice big um, sitting area right here to sit with your friends and um, just hang out um, so we have we did all new flooring in here um, all wallpaper throughout all new curtains and um, shades um, throughout everything has molding everywhere we've repainted so this is the side coming in Go. So this is, we put in this fireplace, which heats really well throughout the entire um, rig. We turn it, they have a low or a high setting, and then it has just like an ambiance setting, and it works really well. We don't even hardly turn on the propane heat. Um, it has a TV, just changed out the cabinets or the countertops right here. They look really good. Um, we have curtains over here. Um, so yeah, so this is the couch. I'll show you guys one more time the couch. So this is a home reserve couch. It has uh, seating th or uh, storage throughout in the ottomans and in the base seating over here. So lots of seating over here. And then you have tons of seating over there. 
so that's what this looks like from here so lots of seating if you want to have friends over if you just want to lounge and hang out um, there's tons of seating and then we have a, a nice IKEA uh, dining room set so it's very lightweight and it works really well okay and then I'll turn around and we're also going to take some professional pictures today too so you guys can see kind of a wide angle so this is the kitchen um, we have white uppers and then we did a dark gray on the bottom there is all new um, backsplash throughout and it's all sealed with molding underneath the cabinets is three touch lights which really helps at nighttime um, there is a microwave which we don't hardly use but we do use the stove there is a, that is the refrigerator um, and then there's lots of storage um, under here so tons of storage all throughout this actually pulls out which I'll show you guys so this pulls out oh there's bubbly so we have all of this storage right here here is let me see if I can get a better shot all that storage in there and then that just gets put back in there Elia I'll feed you in a little bit okay and then there is one drawer over there there's a drawer right there more um, storage right here storage underneath there and then storage also underneath the um, refrigerator um, and then these are what the floors look like mm, sorry my phone just oh okay oh, hold on Woo. sorry guys oh it's not I think it's dying huh. okay no see if it'll work now okay so this again is what this looks like here they turned out really really well and then we have the back um, so this is a one bedroom and this is the hallway so this is the bathroom I'll take you into the bathroom first everything has been wallpapered there is not a wall in here that's not wallpapered except for the back of our bed is painted white so we have um, the bathroom we redid the shower and put in this beautiful um, it's called Duma wall and it is super lightweight it's not marble even though it looks like it and um, we love it it's very lightweight and we made the shower base bigger and so that you can actually enjoy taking a shower in there we took out the glass doors because they were gross um, we put in this we built this vanity um, so that you can have more space and we put in a porcelain sink so that you have more sink uh, when you're brushing your teeth or washing your face and all that stuff this is the medicine cabinet lots of storage in there and then we have um, more storage back here which we just put our uh, towels and our uh, toilet paper in so all of that and then you have your toilet right here so this right here like what Brent said this is an entire slide of closet so all of that is a slide and this is a mess because we have kids but this is what we've done for our kids so they all share this and there's some stuff down there like I said <laughs> We just throw it in there. We just shut it. It's fine. Um, and then there's more. There's more in there with hanging space. Um, so we changed out this. This is another uh, butcher block uh, countertop. We love it. Uh, we put in some more wallpaper. Painted all of this white. Put in a nice little mural of a bear on an adventure. This is a queen size bed. This is an upgraded mattress from Bear RV Mattress. Um, so that will come with it. And then you have um, your TV back here. And then Brent built this awesome barn door. So I'll show you guys what that looks like. So if I can. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so that's the barn door. And it slides shut. And I think that's it. We changed out the doors. So they're, um, they're nice doors. The, the ones that came with it, there was like a huge gap. If I can show you guys there was like even more of a gap it like came down to like right here so when you were going to the bathroom or the kids were going to the bathroom it smelled really bad um, so we actually 
um, put in new doors and took it all the way down to the ground too so that you had more privacy. Um, this is what the floors look like. Again, throughout the entire um, rig, we put in uh, base molding and then we also put in crown molding throughout. So you're gonna have crown molding all throughout that's been put up and caulked and all that stuff. So, all right, I think that's it. If you guys have any questions, you guys can let me know. Here's another view. We're gonna put up some professional pictures today for you guys to share, um, but this is it.